Detroit, 27 points, 9 assists, but it wasn't a good first half for you, 1 of 12, but you made the adjustments. What did you do? Uh, I, just, I just settled down. Uh, this game was a lot of emotions. Um, just, just, just within my family, I, and I let that, I let that get to me my, my first half, and that's something I got to mature at and get better at. Um, but I just settled down and, and, and played like I, like I've been playing the whole season in the second half. And I, my main focus is uh, just winning. Uh, all that stats is going to come, and, but my main focus is winning. I thought Coach probably t told you at halftime that you played a good first half, even though you were one for 12, because you had the six assists, one turnover, and you had the four steals. What did Coach Kruger tell you at halftime as far as your game in the first half and moving into the second half? Uh, well, he was just proud of me that, that even though my shots weren't falling, I was I was contributing in other ways, um, just 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 contributing and, and doing the other things that re required to, to to have a team win. And uh, he knew I was going uh, to score and. He knew I was going to be able to score and get into my rhythm in the second half, but he just wanted me to settle down and, and play my game. I'm sure Coach has told you in the past his teams were really good defensively, and tonight you guys were really good defensively. You didn't get your 94 points a game, but no. what was your game plan coming in defensively against a really good Texas Tech team? Oh Well, well they're very well coached, and they run their offense um, to, to the final seconds. Um, so we knew we had to, to buckle down and, and, and be solid for, for a full 30 seconds every possession, and uh, we knew it was going to be tough, but uh, we, we were ready for the challenge, and I feel like the reason why we won tonight was on the defensive end. It wasn't because of our scoring and, and all that in the second half. It was because we, we settled down and, we, and we, we played defense, and that was the main focus. I thought you adjusted well in the second half to their defense because they were attacking you off the pick and roll with the doubles, and you got into the lane, but you found Kadeem. You found open guys on the perimeter. You know What was your mindset coming down the stretch as far as the balance between looking for your own shot and your teammates? Oh, just, just making the right read. Um, if there was a, a lane and uh, a, a crease that I could get through and, and was able to score. Uh, I was going to try to do it, but uh, I, there were times that the help side defender wasn't wasn't reach, going all the way over to to help on the roll man. So I wanted to to get Kadeem the ball and, and have him finish and make plays. Um, but it was just about making the right read and 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 doing that the the whole second half. And uh, I, I was happy I did that a little bit better. TCU in here next. It's yeah. getting easier for you guys. No, no easy, no easy game in this, in this league. So it's going to be tough, but they're, they're very well coached. Coach Dixon, it's going to be a good game. 27 points, nine assists for Trey Young tonight here in Norman.